Hi, welcome to you all in my YouTube channel. And today I'm going to discuss about Germany. Germany is uh, one of the uh, very good uh, country for pharmacists. So I'm going to make these two videos. One is for is about pharmacy education in Germany. Another will we'll talk about those are already pharmacists. I mean, those are B-Form or, or the formed graduate from India and Pakistan, and they want to work there. So you have to um, see these two videos they will give you the uh, clear picture what is the standard on those countries and how to crack that exam is very easy for you so germany you know germany have that berlin is the capital and that they are the neighbor country like netherland a very beautiful country and france another very very beautiful country then poland poland is the one of the poorest country in the uh, in the europe and the Republic and Austria are a small country so the good countries like Netherlands, uh, France and Germany one of the powerful country and one of the most beautiful country as well but um, most of the time they are always the weather is very cold and all these so let's come to the pharmacist pharmacists are working there mostly the pharmacists are women you know the, the girls are the, uh, uh, and, uh, you know in India mostly we call like women equality and all these but nothing in uh, not in a single uh, profession indians are i mean the women are competing in uh, because of the government and our uh, mentality and all these uh, the, our culture a lot of the factors are affecting that but in germany the women are in number one in pharmacists is about 70 percent pharmacists there are women are working in the uh, pharmaceutical industry and retail pharmacy and all these so what is the pay scale for pharmacists in Germany is about five to six thousand US dollar monthly um, in on an average you can say like fifty thousand um, uh, US dollar per yearly a pharmacist can earn in Germany so very very good country and uh, you know here in another important there the if you are planning to Germany because here education is free so nothing you need to pay for your children or something i mean up to 12 then degree master pd everything is free in germany so this is one of the uh, most advantage and healthcare also free in germany you know so a lot of the things they are given even they give after retirement uh, some monthly wages and all these so a lot of the advantage to work in germany so let's begin in germany uh, there is no master degree and bachelor degree they call this is called diplom d-i-p-l-o-m this is just i mean they have very separate uh, system is uh, is totally different from indian and pakistani system so so understand for this if you want to be a pharmacist then you have to clear three exam and uh, these exams like uh, they are divided into a three phases is like similar like mbbs in india like you know first f uh, first uh, 18 months then second and third then you have to go for uh, internship a similar kind of the things they are doing here so the first two years you have to study in a basic science basic science means you have to study chemistry then biology then physics and medicine so these are the like first four semester first two years i mean your degree is about four years in first two years you have to study about the subject and very intensive laboratory training and then you have to write a examination because you know the in germany mostly in the education in the german language not in the english very few university only offering education in in, in english so uh, you have to be very competent in the language in the in the German language don't only you can be finished this uh, degree here so uh, they say that the ground studium this is called like basic science first two years you have to study if you finish this course and uh, I mean then you have to write a exam examination I mean uh, you have to um, uh, you have to be in a school or you have to be in a university but the examination is taken by that particular state government it is similar like in india if you are doing a diploma or something then that, that a particular state government they have to take a examination so similar kind of uh, the system in germany so these first two years you have to finish then you can go for a advanced uh, courses 
so this is called advanced degree this is also called this is called uh, hop studio so and um, in this you, as you are you know you can transfer after your basic degree you have to go for an advanced degree this is a second phase so even you can transfer your uh, uh, your university or your college if you want to go to any another uh, degree i mean after that your basic degree then you can go for dentistry you can go for medicine you can go for pharmacy so we are talking about just pharmacy we are not talking about medicine and pharma and dentistry but the system is similarly they are working the same the same system first you have to go for the basic science two years then you have to go for advance in advance you can go for dentistry you can go for medicine you can go for pharmacy so our focus here is on the pharmacy so in the third year what you will study you have to study like pharmaceutical or medicinal chemistry or pharmaceutical biology then you have to go for pharmaceutical technology like pharmaceutics formulation development and all this then you have to be studying this pharmacology and toxicology and clinical uh, pharmacy or we can say the pharmacy practice so all this is about uh, one to one and a half year you have to study then you have to give a second examination it is then you can advise again is the state the particular that the state then we have to go for a third phase so first phase is a basic science second phase is a advanced degree then third phase is a uh, we can say like internship or the or uh, practical training something we can call so this is the third phase this is called a practice so in first third phase you have to go six month training in any of the community pharmacy either you can go for a hospital pharmacy or either you can go for a industry so in these three options you have any one you have to go for six months then simultaneously you have to study something like pharmaceutical practice and jurisprudence i mean pharmacy practice and jurisprudence what is the law in germany and what is the law in that particular state where you want to be a uh, work and then you have to write a examination so this is total is about 4 to 5 years in pharmacy uh, degree in uh, in germany then you can be a registered pharmacist there and you can work as a pharmacist for international student there is nothing you need to pay if you are 12 from india you can get directly get a examination here there is no uh, rule for there is no um, need to write any exam for pharmacy uh, 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 if you want to work i mean if you want to get admission in pharmacy or medicine or dentistry but you have to show your competency level in the education i mean in the language language they are asking for germany you can speak well you can talk in in german and you can write in, uh, in german you know so you, so that if you are study basic understanding about in german language then you can go uh, on all these so if you are new in my channel so please subscribe my channel and i already uploaded about 150 uh, videos in around the world whatever your profession is you are looking job or you want to work in um, in, in, in any country please subscribe my channel and i will continue my second video if you are pharmacist in your country and you want to be work as a pharmacist in germany and thank you for watching this video